Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Sorry, it's been a few weeks since I've been able to post a video. So the T is that the car was damaged. Um, I don't know if it was in transit or when it was getting delivered, but you'll see here shortly how bad the damage is. Um, I've just been trying to work things out with the transport company, so that's why it's been a few weeks since I've been able to upload the update video, but here it is. <laughs> First time I've taken delivery of a car like this. It's super fancy, so I'm really excited. Come down. Come down. Come down. Come down. This guy's gonna block the way. So as you guys saw in the video, the rocker panel on the passenger side was essentially pulled off. Um, we don't know how it happened, um, but basically the part cost approximately $900. We ordered that at a dealership um, in the area, in the Los Angeles area. Labor was about $150. So it came out to just over $1,000 for that repair. And the transport company is reimbursing us for exactly that amount. They actually won't reimburse us for any gas or inconvenience. I was pretty upset because, I mean, this is a somewhat collectible car and now it's not 100% original anymore. That kind of 
that kind of sucks, but what can you do? I'm just really glad that it wasn't a painted piece, like a door or a bumper. That would have really sucked. Um, so luckily, it was just a plastic piece. Um, just really, you know, not happy because we paid more to have it um, delivered by an enclosed company that supposedly had a really good reputation. But on a positive note, the reimbursement process was pretty seamless. I mean, accidents do happen. I'm just really thankful that it wasn't a painted piece because that would have been a really bad situation. If you guys have ever had a situation like this with a transport company or with any moving company in general, let me know what your experience was, how it was resolved. I'm really curious to find out if this is a common occurrence, um, especially with enclosed transporters. As always, thank you so much for watching, guys. If you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, be sure to do so. There's going to be some great content coming out with this car soon. See you guys in the next video.